Welcome to the University of Finley Art and Culture Show. I am your host, Sharenda, and today on set we have Mr. Sean Felipe. Welcome. Hi. I didn't even know who he started. <laughs> And that's what makes him the funny man. Sean is a comedian, yes. and we are so excited to have you on set today. Thanks for being here. Oh, thank you, Sharinda. And I know right now you are on a national tour. You are busy in clubs as well as you do college campuses, correct? Uh, that's, if that's the word, yes. <laughs> that's the word. <laughs> yeah. Busy once a month. Uh, oh, he's being so humble at the moment. <laughs> Uh, you are in demand, and I know that because I have seen you showcase at some pretty awesome conferences where there are well, thousands, thousands who want to book you. Yeah. So, yeah, you, keep, stay with <laughs> me. You're just going to keep feeling better. Um, but with comedy, uh, comedians oftentimes draw their material from specific places. And what I love about comedy is that each comedian is an individual mm -hmm. and has a different perspective on life and then they can bring that to the stage. And so could you tell us a little bit about your background and what preempted your interest in comedy? Well, I just pretty much talk about my life and it's like, like an autobiography about myself. Um, so I ended up talking about my ethnicity and how I was raised by my really immigrant mom. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, I'm from Honolulu, Hawaii, so mm -hmm. that's really different. Mm -hmm. It's part of the United States, but not. Uh, so I touch on those things. Uh, all my material just pretty much comes from my, 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 my embarrassing stories and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. And so I get this question from audience members often, did that really happen? Is that yes. the truth? Uh, but sometimes part of the world of comedy is taking a little bit and embellishing it just a tad for that aha effect. Yeah, it's based 50% of truth and uh -huh. the rest is like your creative outlook on things, mm -hmm. your, your, your perspective. Sure. And so uh, part of the world of comedy is also hustling. Yes, I can. That, I don't do hustle. Yeah. It's, it's tough. But you do. Yeah, you I do. You do I it do. in a different way. Because in, a in addition to comedy, you also have been on a reality television show. Yes, I have. Uh, Tell me about that. The, the, on the Food Network, I yeah. did this show called The Great Food Truck Race with Tyler Florence. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, and we won the whole entire uh, competition. So we won money and a food truck. And, and if people are traveling in Hawaii, can they find that food truck and eat from it? Yes. Yeah? It's operating in uh, Honolulu, Hawaii, and it kind of roams around because it's mobile. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, it's called Aloha Plate. Mm -hmm. uh, I believe they have a website where you can find out where it is and they serve you mm -hmm. spam. Oh, spam. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's better than octopus. <laughs> <laughs> octopus is delicious. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, you're an entrepreneur because you have this business, you have comedy, and then you also, I have seen your face in some national co uh, commercials. Commercials. Uh, have so a that movie. makes you an actor? Makes me an actor. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, have a new movie coming out. I don't know. It's still in post-production. Uh, it's about gaming. Uh -huh. uh, Dota 2. It's called Underdogs Rising, and um, it's still in editing. We, we filmed that in China. That was interesting too. Yeah. It's just like, uh, because the toy company that, because we did um, the Food Network show, and from the Food Network show, this toy company called um, uh, Pop. Mm -hmm. And they wanted to make characters of us with a food truck. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And then they started a movie company, and uh, they wrote movies and kind of just wrote me into the movie. I don't know how well I'll do. What a compliment. Uh, and I know you're going to do great. We'll see. Back to that humbleness. We'll <laughs> and that comes back to the ethnicity uh, because yeah. your mom is that way. Yeah, my mom's from Thailand. She uh, is, and she is, she is someone that don't draw attention to me, correct? Yes, and, and, and wait still, until I do yeah. a good job. Don't she, tell me too much, but then we'll talk. Yeah. And you're doing that right now, Sean. Yeah. <laughs> I am? Well, you good. are. My mom raised me well. She's going to be so proud of you when yeah. she watches this video. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's, she's, she's a, uh, uh, she doesn't, still doesn't understand what I do, but whatever, you know, I stopped asking for money. And so she's happy. <laughs> yeah, she's good. As long as you bring her a couple yeah. orca, orchids and uh, orchids, give her uh, some hugs. 
Yeah, orchids are. Oh, she likes uh, yellow roses. Oh. Yeah, for friendship. Yes. And they're <laughs> soft. And and I'm glad that you could stay friends with your mom. <laughs> <laughs> You're not? I, I Yes, I am. I am friends with my mom also, yes. That is true. Important. But I don't give her yellow roses. No. What's it mean when your dad gives your mom yellow roses? Because oh, he just divorced. brought... Oh, I don't think so. Because <laughs> <laughs> I just walked in their kitchen yesterday, and there was this beautiful miniature rose bush it potted, and it was these bright yellow flowers. And he said, I'm bringing some sunshine into your life. Oh. So that's that's, yeah, that's not divorce. Nice. That's nice. Yeah. yeah, I think they're yeah. they're doing good. Fifty three years. Oh, wow, isn't that that's awesome? A long time, yeah. It is. But why are Does we talking about them? Yeah. <laughs> does he still have his hearing? Well, actually, <laughs> he does. So uh, back to Sean. You're deflecting. Okay. Yeah. So we met. We've been friends probably about nine, ten years. We were talking about probably that. Ten years, yeah. Yeah, and uh, in that time, we have had the opportunity to celebrate your comedy. And um, one of the things that we got to work on together was a fundraiser for. Uh, let's see, my mind just went blank. Um, it's okay. It, does it happen to you too? I have dyslexia and ADHD. Okay. Yeah, that's why I only can do comedy. <laughs> if you get it backwards, it's okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay, because you can bounce. Yeah. yeah All right. Yeah, Thank you. <laughs> Broadway Cares Equity Fights AIDS. That's what it was. Uh, we hosted you a few years ago, and you were so wonderful to help us with raising money for that. And I know that um, you have had the opportunity to do some clubs in the U.S. So what have been some of your fun clubs to do in big cities? So if some of our viewers are watching and they want to look for you in the future, where oh. can they look for you? Uh. Right now, they can just go to my website. That's probably the easiest. Great. Let's uh, let's have that. What's yeah. your website? Sean Felipe. And will you spell Felipe for us, please? F How do you spell it? F-E-L. -E -E. Yeah, there, there you go. Yeah, someone, com. someone said Philippe. Yeah. Oh, man. Do you get that a lot? Yes. Philippe, Felipe. It's Felipe. Like, it has the stuff at the end. Yeah. Like something good. Yeah. I, like I think of I think of a little um, dancer, Felipe. Yeah. 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 At the yeah. end. Yeah. There you yeah, go. Like, <laughs> so and Sean, how do you spell that? Because there's a ton S of ways to spell that. What, how would you like to spell it today? S H A W N F E L I P E dot com. Great. And you can find my comedy on Spotify. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. And then you also have an Instagram account. Yes. It's the same name, mm -hmm. Sean Felipe. Mm -hmm. All together, one word. Great. It makes it easier for the Hawaii people to understand. <laughs> and you've, speaking of Hawaii people, weren't you on the television show Hawaii? Yes, I was. It was a, a, a guest appearance. Uh huh. That's uh, got to be fun, just to fly yeah. in and do a few lines and fly out, and not have to worry about the shooting it, schedule yeah. all the time. And uh, I think it was Bane. Um, he was Terminator. Uh huh. Uh -huh. The guy who was trying to kill Terminator before in the original movies. He, yeah. He shot me too in that. Oh, so you've been you've been killed yeah. by a famous killer. Yeah, famous killer. On television. But he was a cop. But I was a bad guy. Yeah. Can you see this as a bad guy? I'm not seeing I'm it. Bad all the time. Like <laughs> my fiance says. Oh, and congratulations oh, on your fiance. I know, I know. Yeah. That's so exciting. Is it? I think it is. Second one. <laughs> you ha sometimes you have to do it for practice the first time to get it right. I think I got it this time. I think you did too. She's pretty cool. Yeah, not bad. Yeah. So, well, thank you so much for coming to the University you, of Finley, enough. stopping by for this interview. Uh, it's always exciting when a friend is in the neighborhood and wants to chat. Yeah. So we appreciate you taking that time. And best of luck with the movie that's getting ready to come out. I would not mind an invitation to that premiere. Oh. It makes it. It will make it. It will make it. <laughs> you don't do no junk, my friend. It's going to be great. So, so nice. <laughs> thank you for tuning in to the University of Finley's Art and Culture Show. Until the next time, keep laughing and be well.